Hello everyone. Today's shout out goes to Nicole and Alessandro. Are you ready for a new story? Today we are going to tell giraffe in the bath because we are following all our phonic um, sessions and this time it's the phonic letter B is the turn for letter B. Okay, are you ready? Should we start? Giraffe in the Bath by Russell Punter and David Semple. Giraffe's in the garden. She talks up thick weeds, then digs a big border and plants leafy trees. Giraffe is tired out. She trots up the path. Now I'm grubby and muddy. I need a hot bath. She jumps in the tub with a splish and a splosh. The bubbles float upwards. She gets set to wash. The phone goes ring, ring. She runs to reply. So sorry, wrong number. Giraffe gives a sigh. She's all wet. Then three minutes later, knock, knock at the door. A package for Jacko. Not me, that's for sure says Giraffe. Giraffe tries to relax with her eyes tightly shut. But Baboon backs his truck, whoops, through the side of her hut. Oh my goodness. He just destroyed his her hut. But the bathtub goes sliding through the slippery soap. It glides out of the door, down a really steepy slope. Look out, shouts Giraffe, her voice all a quiver. Ten zebras take over as she heads to the river. With a crash and a splash, Giraffe lands by a raft. Soon her bathtub is bobbing past lots of odd craft. Look, there's a zebra, there's a bear, an elephant, and I think this is a rhino. It's a race. She ended up in a race. She floats over the line in the big, Bat of race. What a win, cries the judge. Here's your prize for the first place because she finished first. And this is the end of our story. Did you like the story? Did you learn any new words with the letter B? What happened to the giraffe at the end? Let's keep in touch for the next story. Bye.